I can't profess to understand God's plan. Christ promised the resurrection of the dead. I just thought he had something a little different in mind. This is what takes us down. This is our extinction event. You are not safe. No matter how many people are around or how clear the area looks, no matter what anyone says, no matter what you think, you are not safe. It only takes one second. One second and it's over. There is no hope. And you know it now, like I do. There is no army. There's no government, no hospitals, no police. It's all gone. As far as we can see, at least half the population has been wiped out. Why do we want Carl to live in this world? To have this life? So that he can see more people torn apart in front of him. So that he can be hungry and scared for how long he has before he. So that he can run and run and run and run and then even if he survives, he ends up. He ends up just another animal who doesn't know anything except survive. I can sacrifice one of us for the greater good because because we are the greater good. We're the reason we're still here, not me. This is life and death. How you live, how you die. The good people, they always die. And the bad people do too. But the weak people, come on. The people like me, we have inherited the earth. You once said, we don't kill the living. That was before the living tried to kill us. Starting right now, we have to live in the real world. We have to control who lives here. Now if y'all wanna live, if you wanna survive, you gotta fight for it. I'm talking about fight right here, right now. And I see red, I see red. Everything is red, everything I see is red, and I do it. You don't belong here, get out. What happened, Rick? I thought you weren't a good guy anymore. Ain't that what you said? Even right here, right now, you ain't gonna fight for him. I'm a better father than you, Rick. I'm better for Lord than you, man. Because I'm a better man than you, Rick. Because I can be here and I'll fight for it. But you come back here and you just destroy everything. You just wanted to hide. He knew where we were and you didn't care. You just hid behind those fences and waited for me. They're all gone now, because of you! They counted on you! You were their leader! We do what we need to do, and then we get to live. But no matter what we find in DC, I know we'll be okay. Because this is how we survive. We tell ourselves that we are the walking dead. <laughs>